So hi guys, for today I will be going to review is this um, Maybelline Fit Me Concealer. So I got this at Robinson's department store here in Batangas at Lipa City for only 199 pesos. So kahit sa mga malls, as a malls or so called sons, uh, mahabili rin kayo ng Fit Me Concealer. So ito, I have a sun beige with a sun, by, sun sable which is um, number 20. So, this for only 199 and even though there are so many reviews and raves about this um, Fit Me Concealer, pero gusto ko lang siyang itry for my oily and acne prone skin. And of course, medyo sensitive din ako nowadays. So, madaling magkaroon ako ng skin reactions when it comes to um, using other products on my face. So, matetest din natin to if you have a, a skin type like mine. So, titingnan natin kung swak siya sa mga oily, acne prone, and sensitive skin. So, ito. Hindi ko pa siya nabubuksan. This is my first time and this will be my first impression and review about this Maybelline Fit Me Concealer. So, open ko lang siya guys. Kakalug-kalugin ko lang siya guys. And then, actually, marami na itong nakapag-review nito ha. Um, marami dyan sin Anclots, um, sin Anclots, um, Anakai, I guess. So, marami pa. Even internationally na mga YouTube content creator, um, lalo na mga makeup junkies, um, they have already um, reviewed this Fit Me Concealer. So, try natin siya guys. So, on my right side of my face, I will be using the um, brush, which is this, a ordinary brush. And then, on my left side of my face, I will be using the dump sponge. Wala siyang amoy, guys, definitely. So, it's a plus for me, Billy. For me, Billy. So, um, ano nga pala, I didn't put anything on my face aside from my sunblock and moisturizer. And my eyebrows, I've done my eyebrows already. Oh my god. Parang mali yata yun. Nakuha ko. Shade guys. Oh my god. Parang yellow undertone niya, no? Super yellow undertone for my skin type kasi I have a very fair skin. Hindi man super fair skin, pero maputi lang talaga. Maputi lang talaga ako. So, I don't think. So, makikita nyo naman, medyo may eye bags din ako. At saka pupuyat. And then, try natin with a brush. Kunti lang ako guys maglagay ng concealer as you can see kasi mas gusto ko pa rin yung parang um, very translucent pa rin yung skin, yung skin ko. Parang skin ko pa rin yung makikita nyo or makikita ko sa akin. Ayoko ng sobrang um, cakey or yung sobrang kapal ng concealer. Dahil ayoko magmukhang meron akong suot uh, ang foundation or anything on my face even though Marami rin naman akong blemishes and um, problems on my skin. So, ayoko lang para talagang nakikita mo na meron akong suot na makeup. Even though may makeup naman talaga. So, here you go guys. And, makikita nyo naman. Ito yung side ng face ko na merong Fit Me Concealer. And, ito yung side na wala. So, makikita nyo naman na mas nag-brighten talaga yung under eye ko, under eye bags, and dark circles dito sa area na to. Even though this is a very um, yellow undertone, or yellow yung kanyang kulay, so perfect pa rin for um, fair skin. Yung isa kasi, um, number is not number 10, light, basta it's something light beige yata yung kulay. So, mas natakot ako dun, baka kasi super light niya. Kaya yung sun beige na lang yung kinuha ko. So, yan. Makikita nyo naman. Um, maganda yung naibigay niyang um, coverage 
So, maganda yung naibigay niya coverage for me, even personally. Um, na madali, madali din siyang i-blend. Hindi siya thick, hindi rin siya um, watery ang consistency. So, yan. Ang, konti, ang konting gamit mo lang, ang konting ano mo lang sa uh, um, concealer, makakover na niya halos ang mga problems mo under eye. So, yun. So, um, dito naman tayo sa left side of my face. Ito namang sponge ang gagamitin ko. Hindi ko magawang even yung kanya ano. Kasi kapag sponge ang ginamit mo, ang tendency kasi nito, mas mapapanitis niya yung pag apply mo or yung foundation or concealer sa face mo. So, yun. Kaya, mas mukhang, kaya para mo hindi siya pantay under my eye. Sa left and right. So, ito na yun, guys. This is the Fit Me Concealer under my eyes. So, parehas naman, maganda yung kanyang um, nagawang pag-blend sa concealer. It's just that parang mas gusto ko yung sa ano, yung sa sponge, sa damp sponge. Kasi parang fine na fine yung pagkaka-apply niya sa aking under eye. Unlike dito sa ginamit na ko ng brush, medyo nag-crease agad na agad siya sa aking under eyes. Makikita naman dito, personally. So, I don't know kung makikita nyo sa camera, pero personally talaga sa aking mirror, um, medyo nag-crease na agad siya. Makikita, makikita na agad yung lines sa aking under eye. So, yun. And then, I will just put on some other parts of my face, this concealer. So, for now, I will be using my damp sponge para i-blend lahat ng concealer. So, I will add additional ano pa. So, this is the second layer na ng concealer on my acne, acne spots. So, here you go guys. This is my final um, look using the Fit Me, Maybelline Fit Me Concealer. So, ang gagamitan ko lang na powder dito is yung Maybelline din na White Super Fresh White Super Fresh UV Whitening last, Long Lasting to Week. So, I'm using the brush that I bought from number 2 shop. So, um, nabanggit ko to sa aking Shopee haul. So, I will just link here on the card yung video kung saan ko siya um, na-review. So, yan guys. Ito na yung aking final look for the day. So, this is my makeup go-to um, everyday. So, yan. So, hi guys. Um, welcome back again to my channel. And, here is my first and final update about this Fit Me Concealer from Maybelline. So, I am on the shade number 20. And, I, nakalimutan ko din na sabihin sa inyo kung oras ko siya ginamit. And, the time it was earlier was um, by 12.30 to 1 p.m. Since I first put this on my face. So, right now is almost 6 o'clock p.m. If I'm not mistaken. So, it's going to 6 o'clock p.m. right now. And, I wore this for 5 hours already. So, yun nga guys, um, ito na siya. Yan. For 5 hours na suot ko siya, of course, hindi ako nag-blot, hindi ako nag-retouch or anything. And then, nakatulog pa nga ako by 5pm siguro kanina. So, ngayon, ito na siya. Mukha na siyang sobrang oily ko na guys. I could say... So, kanina, tinanggal ko na kasi yung aking lenses, sa aking contact lenses, tinanggal ko na siya. So, ngayon, nag, ano na lang ako, nagsalamin na lang ako kasi 
nga natulog ako. And then yun, super oily ko na guys. As you can see, as in my whole face, super oily. So, for my thoughts and final reviews here in Fit Me Concealer. So, it's a very good concealer. So, yun nga lang, mas gusto ko siyang i-apply using the damp sponge. Kasi kapag in-apply mo siya using the brush, napansin po dun sa crease ng eyes ko, sa, dito, sa baba, dun sa ginamitan ko dito, sa left, sa right side ko ng face, which is using, I, I use the brush, medyo nag-crease agad siya for the first, 3 hours, nung maka, makabalik ako dito sa bahay, siya nakuha agad siya, and then nag agad siya sa aking mata. And then dito sa left um, side of my face, wherein I used the, the damp sponge, um, the Fit Me Concealer didn't crease on my um, under eye. So, maganda yung kanyang pagkakablend. Even though nablend ko naman siya dito na ayos, yun nga lang, hindi siya kasing ganda ng pagkakablend dito sa left side since since yun nga um, damp sponge yung ginamit ko dito sa aking left side so mas maganda talaga yung pagkaka um pagkakalagay niya dito so sobrang nipis lang so a little goes a long way for this so ngayon naman nagamit ako ng um blotting paper to see how much of oil I na makukuha ko dito using my blotting paper. So, first time ko guys na magbablot or magiritouch. Ito pa sa may bandang forehead. So, yan. Makikita nyo guys, ba Sobrang oily ko talaga. As in. Almost two sheets yung magagamit ko for my whole face. Para lang mawala yung pagka-oily ko. So, yan. So, actually, dalawa yung nagamit ko, which is, this is the first one, and this is the second one. So, as you can see, I have a very, very oily skin type. So, I guess, it's not just the concealer itself has the problem, but it's just my um, skin that has a problem on some products, even though it says it could really um, stay longer on my face even though um, this Maybelline, I guess, it didn't say that it could really stay on your face or um, it is used for oily skin type but it's just, hindi lang talaga siya tumagal sa aking face pero siguro okay na okay na din for more than um, 3 hours um, andun pa din naman yung concealer andun pa rin siya sa aking under eye so Maganda pa din yung kanyang um, coverage until now. So, yun lang. Kailangan nyo lang siguro talaga ay mag um, blot or mag retouch. If feeling nyo ay very oily skin na yung balat nyo or nagtatake na siya, yung malakit na siya sa pakiramdam. So, for me, um, for this product, I would highly suggest this for those who are starting from makeup or kung gusto nyo na maganda concealer and then maganda rin yung price, very affordable and then yun I will recommend this um, Fit Me Concealer from Maybelline so pili na lang kayo ng shade nyo kung saan kayo so for me, I had this number 20 so I have a very I'm not even, it's not really a fair skin but I have a fair skin and yung sun beige, mas okay naman sa akin so the lightest of this 
that I saw on the Maybelline counter at SM department store is the light which is number 10 and yun, siguro maganda rin siya if you have a very fair skin so, dyan guys um, this is, is the final look of my face after blotting and after 6 hours of wearing this, uh, rather 5 hours of wearing this um, Fit Me Concealer from Maybelline so, yun nga guys, um, if you really wanted to buy this product from Maybelline, which is the concealer, Fit Me Concealer, so don't hesitate to buy this. Because I would really highly recommend this kind of concealer for those people, any skin type. Um, I guess it's very safe to use if you have a very oily, um, normal, sensitive, or acne prone skin. So, it's just that if you know that you have an oily skin type, make sure that you have your own, that you bring your own blotting paper or your retouching kit like your powder. Be thankful for watching and see you again on my next video. Bye!